Okay, guys, so I've been talking ev talking to everyone about the biggest challenge of the movie. A lot of it was physical for them, running in those suits. So what was your biggest challenge when filming this movie? Try not to laugh when working with Charlie. Is, uh, That's your biggest challenge? It, it's worry. not my biggest, but yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> It was nice to be back, you know, it was nice to be back in the sandbox and having a new energy, new cast, apart from a few of us, and uh, right. I, I it mean, wasn't so much a challenge as a, as a you know, exciting to I be back. I think the biggest know. challenge is honouring the characters that you did in the first movie and mm. trying to make sure that uh, uh, in this new movie it seems like a progression from those characters. Um, uh, but it, was, it, was it challenging? I, I don't know. It, yeah, yeah. It's a fun challenge. It's a fun challenge, yeah. Were you guys uh, pleasantly surprised by how epic of a spectacle it is and how much action and adventure is in this film? Yeah, I mean... It's always surprising to see one of these films when they're done, especially for us because so many of our scenes take place uh, in in laboratories yeah. and, and not, like, out in in the, uh, in the action, major action sequences. So yeah. then when you get to see them... You sort of see what the rest of the people have been working on in the movie, yeah, and, yeah. and you, in in some way, experience the movie for the first time. Sure, I've got nothing but admiration for the people that work. You know, the biz effects and the, you know, the hours and hours and hours of, of you know detailed work that goes into it. So it's actually really nice surprise when you see the finished product. Mm -hmm. And talk about uh, the finished product. Talk about like some of the action scenes and stuff because you guys said that you guys did get to see it. Yeah, I'd like to see it in IMAX. Yeah, I'd I think see if you're it, yeah. gonna see the you know the spectacle and the scale of the thing, um, you know, do it do it properly. But, but uh, they're massive action yeah, sequences, yeah, yeah. and uh, and um, the, the huge uh, destruction and the, and the speed of them is uh, yeah, yeah. It, it's quite a spectacle. And I love that this film. I mean, just the fact that it's like robots against like human run robots I mean it's it's everything that you want to see constantly but it's also got a lot of heart in it sure you know thanks to like the mentoring the youth the the female empowerment you know like this lead that's so spunky and smart can you talk about uh, some of the other characters yeah it was actually a real pleasure meeting the new cast you know Kaylee and in fact all the other um, young pilots and John was on this as well from day one, there was a very collaborative, energetic, you know, a way of working. It felt like there was real momentum to it. And also we traveled, you know, we went to Sydney and Australia and the Gold Coast and to China. And, you know, it was it was wonderful being part of this sort of traveling circus, you know. It was exciting to see. They've taken this movie and they've put it on the shoulders of a new young cast. Uh, for us, it's fun to come and re reprise our roles and we're there for a bit. But the storyline is really weighing on the shoulders of this younger cast, some of these people, it was their first movie. Uh, and that joy and excitement that they bring to set, just getting to be a part of a major movie is um, a good reminder for us about uh, how lucky we are to, to do what we do. Mm. So what is it about this movie that made you guys say, I really want to come back, I want to reprise my role, and I want to be a part of this again? Back in 2013, it was an original live action universe. That doesn't come along that often. You know, and so it was lovely to come back into um, that very complex world. You know, personally, I'm a sci-fi and genre fan. I like escaping to to other worlds. You know, uh, mentally, um, and so it was exciting to to come back and play in that. Yeah. For me, I, I really wanted to. Uh, I didn't want to walk away and abandon what Guillermo del Toro had started, and he wanted this to be a big franchise, and. Uh, and he'd written this wonderful character and given me this opportunity. Um, and even though he wasn't able to direct this one, I still wanted to be a part of this world that he created. Um, uh, so I just, I really wanted to honor that. Last question. There are so many fun toys that are on the set all the time, as well as behind the scenes. Yeah. What was your favorite toy to play with or interact with, or perhaps like just take a steal of? Yeah, and bring it I, home? I like playing with with brains. You know, Kaiju right. plays. They've got they've got a very interesting texture. You know, it's a, it's it's always fun. Yeah, manipulating. Uh, just some of the sets that I uh, was in were, were really, you know, people suspended from uh, the, the drone pilots who are in these rigs and they have these helmets on and they're they're there all day and thank god i was not in one of those but it was really interesting to look at them and say you okay up there pal you know somebody get this guy water but uh it was a great set to be on